if you do enjoy my FIFA content or you just love saying I'm shit at FIFA in the comments, then click the subscribe button down below. Welcome back to another video. Today we have got a talking to you guys video. Um, as you see by the title of this video, it is what is happening to football. Um, before I start this video, um, I'm trying to uh, fill in for videos that I can't do on the console. Get as many videos as I can that don't need the console. So, um... Yeah, just got that out of the way, and also if you want me to go, uh, do uh, leave me video 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 ideas that don't need a console, so I'll try and do them. Um, but yeah, let's get into this. What is happening to football? This is a massive question. Uh, recently, because yesterday West Ham and Chelsea, uh, the West Ham and Chelsea scores of um, Chelsea being beaten by Crystal Palace, that is a thing that you would never think would happen. It's like these two things are opposite. Like West Ham beating Liverpool three 0 you would never think, never, you would never think that would happen. It, but it has. It's football is changing every second, like every year. Football is changing and making a difference. I know, like the. Uh, the BPL has just recently started and there's a long way to go before the end and things could change like that but recently West Ham as well beating Arsenal 2-0 this was such a great achievement that some guy had to get this tattooed on his ass on his ass he had to put the, the, the score on his bottom because it was such a memorable moment that won't come again but we don't know if it will come again because football is so unpredictable um, see it then our next game, I don't know what I think we're playing Man City. See, that one, you would obviously think we would lose. But we probably will lose. But you just need to think that we could win. Because you'd never think that would beat Arsenal, but we did. Which is so strange, because you don't know what's going to happen. And you don't know what's going to be around the corner. Um, as well as Ch Chelsea losing to Crystal Palace. I'm not actually sure what happened in that game. It was probably down to penalties, but I didn't know. I haven't actually looked at that game. But... That Crystal Palace, they must have been screaming of joy because they'd never think that they'd beat Chelsea in their life. Um, but Chelsea now stands at 13th in the table. That may go up. I don't see them winning whatsoever. I don't see them winning the BPL this year. I see Man City actually winning because having Man City not uh, lose a game so far and they're at the top, I don't think they are going to win Chelsea. I think uh, Man City or Man United may have a chance of coming first second but um, Crystal Palace is actually for second in the table and West Ham are seventh. West Ham are doing so good because West Ham there is some sort of opposite because us losing against Bournemouth and us losing against uh, Leicester and us winning against two amazing teams. Uh, it's it's mind-blowing but um it's also i feel sorry for all these guys that actually bet on these games because you guys must be really annoyed with yourself thinking that you go with the easy option but you just don't win because it's the opposite has happened you guys can leave your comments down below on what your opinion is on this um i see it changing rapidly like the bpl will change instantly probably instantly yeah i thought i'll just share this with you um my opinion on what is happening to football uh, in the or what's happening to the bpl um leave a comment down below on your thoughts on this and uh, also leave a comment down below what video ideas you want me to do without console so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and um if you want me to do more videos like this my opinion videos and leave a comment down below and uh see you guys in the next one peace guys